Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Janice and today we are filming a Thanksgiving cook with me vlog. I guess we can call it a vlog. Uh, it is Wednesday, November 23rd, which means it's the day after my birthday and the day before Thanksgiving. Our family always gets together every year. We have kind of like a potluck style Thanksgiving dinner. So everyone is designated to have what they're gonna cook and bring. We pretty much keep it the same every year where everyone brings the same thing. And I am always responsible for the greens, the potato salad, deviled eggs and then this time we're actually doing a fun little like baking contest and so I've decided to make an apple galette. So that is what I'm going to be doing today. It is 1.52. I'm getting started extremely late hence the coffee because it's probably going to be a long evening. Ezzy is currently taking a nap. She's been asleep for a while though so she probably she's probably going to be waking up in a little bit. Ignore my hands because they're extremely dry because I've been actually prepping and washing the potatoes and apples and all that stuff so everything's ready to start chopping and cooking and simmering. We're going to be going through a lot of eggs clearly because <laughs> potato salad requires eggs as well as deviled eggs obviously. So a lot of boiling of things, boiling of potatoes, boiling of eggs. So that is kind of what I want to get started on first is just get everything in the pots boiling. But I just wanted to welcome you guys to the vlog. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys have a great Thanksgiving. And uh, let's see how this night is going to go. I'm trying to make it fun. I'm going to put on some music. I just uh, got this coffee delivered from Enchanted Coffee. I told you guys about that in my previous vlog. The vlog I'm actually uploading right now, which is another reason why I'm starting to cook late. I edited and uploaded a vlog, so that is going up today, which is on Wednesday. Um, and yeah, so subscribe down below if you're new. <laughs> and uh, let's get started on this long evening. <laughs> because I actually decided that I'm gonna bake it at my parents' house because Thanksgiving's at my parents' house this year. I'm gonna bake it there. So I'm gonna have it all, the filling's all in there, the pie crust, everything created, made in its pan that can just go straight into the oven just because I do want to win the contest for one. But I, I just think like anything that's kind of like pie form is better when it's fresh. So I just want to bake it there when I'm getting ready to serve it and then I'm going to serve it with a scoop of ice cream and I think it's going to taste delicious. So I might include a little bit of tomorrow in this vlog just even if it's just showing the um, baking competition footage and just give you guys so you guys see who won and all that good stuff. I think it'll be fun. I actually should have gotten some stuff into the I was supposed to do that. But yeah, so that's where we're at right now. I already feel like this coffee's not really working. <laughs> but um, we're just gonna keep pushing through. I wanna get as much done as possible so that I don't start getting like way too tired to even think of doing things. So I, I was trying to wait a little bit because I wanted Ezzy to help me out. Not necessarily help me, but participate. I wanted to kind of make it a mother-daughter like Thanksgiving, the first time she's ever really like helped me in the kitchen for Thanksgiving. And I think it'll be fun, so, but she eats really slow and I don't know if I can wait that long. Huh, my girl? Look like Orbeez or 
<laughs> so, oh, by the way, I didn't even tell you guys. I got a new phone. I got the iPhone 14 Pro. I wanted to get the Max, but the Max was completely back ordered and I did not want to wait for that. I already had to wait a couple days for this to get delivered because they didn't have it in stock. So I didn't want to wait for the back order. So I have a, it's a bit smaller than what I've had in the past, but it's still cute. Mom, can you wait for me to finish all my food? Too? Okay, well you have to hurry though. Mommy's gonna start getting it prepped. So let's go do that. It's a lot later. I am getting tired. <clears throat> my energy is leaving for sure. I actually never finished my coffee, so I think I'm gonna warm that up right now and try to drink the rest of that. 
Uh, I have completed the uh, deviled eggs, the potato salad. I did most of the uh, apple galette. I just need to roll out the dough and put the filling in and then fold over the dough. I was originally gonna like make little cute like um, like cutouts with cookie cutters and stuff, but the way my energy is set up right now. I don't know, maybe if I get some time tomorrow morning, maybe I can do that, because again, I think I told you guys already that I'm gonna bake it at my parents' house once we get there, just so it's fresh. So I still have a little time to like decorate it, I guess. And we're not going over there until one tomorrow. So that's a possibility, but I don't know. We'll see how I feel. But um, the greens are on, they're simmering. They're probably gonna be going the rest of the night. Um, at least as long as I can stay up and then I'll turn it off and then turn it on again early in the morning That's usually how I like to do it Nathan is gonna go grab us some food because obviously with all this cooking and all this stuff I'm doing I'm not trying to also cook dinner and it's taken a little bit longer because I'm actually Creating two separate like I did two separate potato salads and two separate deviled eggs um, because for the kids me and my sister are very similar in like giving them our kids healthy food and whatnot and so obviously I don't want to completely change the whole taste of everything for everyone so I like to make a smaller batch for the kids so that they have like better quality less sugary things uh, on Thanksgiving that's why things take a little longer and then obviously just trying to clean as I go because I also don't want like a huge mess when I'm done and I'm already tired and then I have to look at a sink full of dishes. So I've just been kind of washing, taking breaks to wash dishes and I'm um, still needing to take care of Ezzy. Nathan got home a little early today. He took her with him to the store which was nice. Oh my gosh, I didn't even tell you guys the chaos. The chaos which is why my greens are barely like... I mean, they've, they've been on for a while now, but they could have been on way longer. I made a mistake thinking that I ordered chicken broth in my Instacart order. Somehow, the order got here, the same with onions. Somehow my order got here and I'm looking like, where is my chicken broth? It's not there. And I learned that I did not order it because originally when I was doing my Instacart order, I was kind of looking for specific things, but based off of how the price of it to try to get this cheapest price so i was searching it on instacart and so i had created multiple like i guess uh, carts at different stores as i was kind of searching for things and completely forgot when i decided to just order from sprouts that when i selected the chicken broth and the onions that it wasn't at sprouts it was at one of the other stores so oh i had to um I tried to do a Sprouts Express because they have that on the app out here. I've never had that when we lived in Yucaipa, but since we moved out here, there's a few of the stores that have like Instacart Express and you can get your order within like 15 to 30 minutes. You only have to spend $10 or more to get it free. So it's really, really cool. But I guess with tomorrow being Thanksgiving and everyone's cooking and at the store and probably Instacarting, um, I placed the order and then at the time when I was like, oh, shouldn't it be here by now? I checked and it was canceled. So I think either they couldn't find a driver or maybe they couldn't, the driver wouldn't have been able to get the stuff here in time, I don't know. But that kind of messed me up. So Nathan had to leave and go to the store once he got home from work and get me some chicken broth. And it's just been a little, a little uh, crazy. And then <laughs> I did the same thing, the same exact thing that I'm telling you I did with the chicken broth and the onions. I did that with the collard greens, with the greens, the main thing I'm cooking. I thought that I had placed the order with sprouts. Come to find out it was in another cart that I had started when I was doing some research because the greens are a lot for organic for a bundle. So I was trying to find, you know, the best price and that just messed me up. So I had to place an express order for that as well. So it's just been a little bit chaotic and I'm really tired. I've been going all day. Like I said, I edited and uploaded a YouTube video all in one day today to get that up. And it's just been a very long day and it's almost eight o'clock. So that's 
God, I see update. So if you want an example of how my day is going, here we are. That coffee I told you I was gonna warm up. Uh, I got distracted and started doing other things. Left it in a little too long. It completely exploded in the microwave. But on top of the fact that now I have more to clean, there's literally nothing in there. So, yeah. Good afternoon, guys. Happy Thanksgiving. It is 12.15. We're running a little behind. We're supposed to be getting to my mom's around 1.00. So, and we have at least an hour drive at oh, the very least. So, tell me that, mommy. Yeah. Um, so we're dressed, we're just getting all the food ready and getting it in the car and trying to find a safe way to transport it. Uh, especially because I have greens and it's sloshy and juicy and I'm a bit nervous about it. But we're excited to Bye -bye. spend the day with family and uh, get things going. So we're gonna get things in the car and I'll catch you guys when we get there, right? Say bye! bye. bye. Now we are doing the spice cake by my cousin Jasmine over here. <laughs> Starting in order that we serve, explain a little bit, not doesn't have to be dramatic, about what you did so that they can rate the difficulty of your dish. So, I know. Ouch. Right here. One. Two. 
Oh, nice, dude. <laughs> so, thank you guys for partaking. I think we should, uh, we'll get better each year and change it up, do different things to have contests on. Was Miss Marshawn nice? Second place. Second place. Oh. What you said for difficulty? Second place for presentation. Who? Was also Mrs. Marsha. Oh, get it, sir. Two for two. Runner up for taste. We have. Who? For second. Also. Oh, you said you didn't have to Also. Mrs. Williams. Shanice. now and realize I did not do an outro for this video so I just want to say thank you for watching uh, Thanksgiving was a lot of fun and it was perfect honestly just a nice little get together with family um, starting new traditions so that was great but um, I hope you guys had a great one as well and I guess we're gonna get ready for all the Christmas content now because Thanksgiving is officially over and I officially feel no guilt <laughs> and getting the Christmas stuff going. So again, thank you for watching. Subscribe down below if you are new to the channel and uh, make sure to go follow me on Instagram. I have both a my main Instagram and I have a bookstagram. I have those linked here and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your Thanksgiving break. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.